so. Recently, I saw a video by Pipe Friend CHS where he opened the video by panning over a cup of burn up matches that he had sitting around. And this was very inspiring to me because I love burnt matches because they each they sort of tell a little story and a very simple story, but I like that. Um, the story this one tells is that it took a little while to get that pipe going. And the story this one tells is it took less time, but something happened. Something vigorous lighting because uh, the tip has fallen off. It's, it's a little bit sharp. And so these are sort of different stories, and I like that. Um, what the hell do you do with all these burnt-up matches, though? Seems like a shame to throw them out. Um, there are many wonderful things that you can do with burnt matches, but one thing you could try that might seem kind of stupid, might seem like something you did in kindergarten, but I think you should try it anyway, is to, or it's still drying, excuse me, Elmer's glue dries clear. So, it will look a lot better in a little while, but I'm excited to show you. Build a little match fiction. Just don't even question it. You have the matchsticks sitting around, I know you do. All of us do. They burn up their trash, basically. Uh, you can read their little stories, but essentially, they're just trash. You could, then this can be trash, but it's an interesting little exercise. Collect your burnt matches. Cover scrap of paper and glue. It can be a magazine ad. It's kind of fun to do little match sketches over that, um, over a magazine ad or something on top of some advertisement. Whatever. Just uh, lay the matches down. It forces you to work in a sort of geometric way with all these straight lines and you can um, just amuse yourself. And then, if you want, you can cover it in ink or house paint or uh, oil or acrylic or whatever you've got around and um, Again, great Christmas present, eccentric, but um, it's a signature. Just remember, it's a uh, sort of a memento mori, and it's and it contained the memories of many great smokes. Don't question it. Don't feel ashamed. In a worst case scenario, you throw it in the trash. But I, I dare you, I dare you to try it, and show me what you do.